Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario RPG. I am the J Kid on the last episode. We were continuing to traverse through the sunken ship. Had a couple uh, hard, tough fights and now we have been surrounded by pirates and they're going to show us some stars. But I guess we're out of luck. See whatever falls into this sea becomes Johnny's property. You got that matey? Looks like our next foe is going to be some guy named Johnny. And there's one last thing, so we're going to read his lips. Oh, you ain't going to let me through, huh? Got it? So these guys are going to stop us from getting through to Johnny and to get the uh, elusive star that we're looking for. So I think we're going to play a game of let's kick these pirates ass. Is. Uh oh, looks like they can last through one hit. Can they last through two? No, they cannot. So these pirates are going to be mince meat by the time I am done with them. Mario's got awesome hammer skills, so it should not be too tough. Looks like they had an attack called Skewer, which does one. So that's really tough. And his does four, so it looks like his is a little tougher. Along with that guy. So let's throw Mario at him. Let's see how they take a Mario. Not very well, it looks. So, and we get it once again, which is always exciting. Mario does all the damage on his own and when Bowser throws him at them. And looks like another once again. So it looks like we're going to finish this battle quick, fast, and in a hurry. Bye bye. See you later. So now the pirates have been taken care of. With some nice, nice, juicy experience. Uh, yeah, we are stronger than we look. I always thought we looked pretty strong, especially Bowser, but... Looks like they're gonna go warn the upper decks. And I'm gonna grab this nice, lovely treasure box. And go up... Uh-oh! So they're now looking for us, but we are behind them, so they cannot find us. They don't see me. No, I didn't get away. Oh, they're gonna try to get me! Run! Oh no, we are surrounded! Oh, but looks like they, the barrel dropped right over us. And taking out the rest of their crew. How did I get up here so fast? I literally just walked up the steps. So it really wasn't that tough. My luck has run out. They don't take... We don't take kindly to strangers around here. Let's kick some pirate ass. What do you guys say? Now we have five instead of four. I think that they're going to be just as easy as the last kind. But especially once I get Bowser's once again in here. If, if they all do the once again perk as the last... Yep, there it is. Then I think we're going to be pretty safe. They probably they might not even get another hit in as soon as I'm done with them. Honestly, Mario, take them all out. And remember, Bowser still has a turn after this, I'm pretty sure. Are we gonna even need Bowser? I don't know. What do you guys think? I don't think so. What is that? There was five of them. Oh, never mind. I was gonna go back for the perfect bowling game, uh, as translated to Mario Super Mario PG fights. But Mario literally just ended the streak there at five. Actually, how many did Bowser have? Uh, it wasn't, it wasn't, it couldn't have been 10 since there's only 4 before that, so. Couldn't have done it. Had to try it later. I might just go back to a lower level or something and just get my perfect game. Because I think that'd be fun for me. So. Mario level up to 13! We got some attack, special attack, or HP. I think I'm gonna grab the HP. Get him nice over 100 now. Yeah, I know, that's what your friend said. I am pretty tough. Oh, he's gonna let us in. No more... No more action uh, taken against us for being here. Let's go in here and let's meet Johnny. Here's Johnny. Looks like he's got blue pirate friends. Yeah, I'm the Mario. Har, 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 har. Not much to look at, huh? So he's also going to take the claim that since the star fell into the sea, that it is his. And if we want it, we're going to have to fight for it. I think that uh, it's not going to be uh, too difficult. We already had some pretty hard battles before, so... We are well prepared for this fight, I would say. The pierce attack from the blue uh, pirates are not any stronger than the skewer attacks of the red pirates. Let's see how uh, Gino takes uh, takes on some pirates. Now, I know if you uh, leave the pirates alive, uh, there's a one-on-one -on -one fight that comes on later that if you leave them alive, you don't get. So I'm going for the one-on-one -on -one fight. So I'm going to take care of the pirates. Johnny looks so big and intimidating, though. He's got a trident. He's the king of the sea. I'm assuming he's like an undead pirate or something. But nonetheless, Johnny's a pretty cool guy. I'm okay with Johnny. Don't be too mad at him for trying to fight us. He's giving us a fair shot at the start. It was his. It fell into his sea, so. He's doing the honorable thing and letting us go all balls out and fight for it. And I am okay with that. Nice little trident miss, though, bro. 
What, you got uh, water in your eyes or something? <laughs> we are underwater, right? Yeah. Okay. So, blue pirate guy should go down to this nice little attack right cha. Bye bye. Nice little uh, shit talking from them. Lucky. Let's hit. Now we're going to focus all our attention onto Johnny the pirate. Come on. Ooh, it looks like he's getting a little tougher now. Should have done a nice little Gina boost, get some attack up, but I'm not gonna worry about it now. Considering that we should get a one-on-one -on -one fight here soon, I think. Actually, maybe if you left him alive, then you got the one-on-one -on -one fight? Now I can't remember. Sorry guys, I might have ruined it. Oh well. Alright, so now that I'm convinced that we're not gonna get our one-on-one -on -one fight, let's you know boost the attack up for him. Uh, also got defense up that time, I don't know why. I must have hit a button or something, that's great. Get tough. So look, now he's hawking up. Uh, now he's a red Johnny. So very scary. Trying to match the color uh, color of Mario, I guess. Fwa ha ha. Not bad, fellas. Thanks. Oh, here's the one-on-one -on -one fight. How bad at Mario? Mario versus me. Want to mix it up? Of course I do. Shake your head yes. Jump up and down. Here we go. Good fun and good for you too. Here we go. Alright, so now we have cheerleaders in our fight against Johnny. I would dare say that my cheerleaders are better. Honestly. So now we have our one-on-one -on -one fight with Johnny. Let's try some special attacks here. How are you going to take a super jump, huh? Johnny? We're going to start about with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think ten is like the limit you can get on bosses now. Because every single boss we do that to, we get up to ten. And no farther, so. Super jump didn't do that much. How about a super flame for our nice little pirate buddy? Let's see how he takes this. Also pretty well. Oh, Bowser. <laughs> Bowser is going nuts over there on our side. And regular attacks seem to be the way to go. We don't really hit him very hard though now, do we? I know I have a power-up boost in my inventory, but I kind of want to save that for things when things get really hairy. I mean, it's going to be tougher bosses. And look at that. I'm glad I didn't use it. Mario takes down Johnny one-on-one. -on -one. And here we go. We should get our star now. Oh, we get to double our XP points. I'm going to do it. Where's Yoshi? Come on. We get, we've been getting ties. Right here. No, we lost all of it. I knew, Oh, my God. He's been on the right like the last like six times. Why am I not doing that? I lost all of that experience. That's not good at all. Not good at all. I know he's impressed, matey. A souvenir of our fight is a star. Johnny is a nice, cool guy. And here comes our amazing star music. We have got our fifth star, I want to say. I think it's our fifth. I think it's the fifth. Uh, it's been a little while since I played the game. Uh, so we'll find out here shortly. But either way, we have a star. The sunken ship has been defeated. It's been great. I actually like the sunken ship, so... I actually like most of the dungeons in this game. Yep, it is our one, two, three, four, fifth star. Only two more to go. So, like I said, game is almost getting over. Everybody nods to each other. And Johnny's going to walk over there and stare out the window. What are your pirate buddies at this time? Johnny's our main man. He even fights in his sleep. They follow him anywhere. Well, he got his ass whipped by the one and only Mario. Hop on the trampoline in the next room and take it outside. Sweet. Johnny, any parting rule? You must have really wanted it. Yeah, I did really want it. Go on, get out of here. All right, buddy. Jump on your head uh, a couple times and let us make haste out of here. Jump on the trampoline. We will get out of the ship. And looks like there's not an extra place for us to go. So let's check out Seaside Town. I know it was really creepy and weird last time. And it's still creepy and weird. Um, e he he. Yeah, I found the star. That's what I, My journey ends. Okay, so it looks like... Yardovich uh, is a member. These guys are a part of Smithy's gang. Um, I'm not really that shocked, but Yeah, okay, your impersonations of ordinary people was very terrible. Honestly, your search for the stars of worried Smithy So uh, if I take the star back to him, I'll earn brownie points. So this is the way to get ahead Okay, so looks like we don't even get a chance to fight him. He's just I'm not gonna give you the star buddy. No Yeah, that's how I want to play it. What do you think will happen in the real inhabitants of C? Uh-oh Looks like all the real inhabitants are in there, and they are going to use them as uh, hostages to uh, get what they want. Looks like their ransom is this star. I have no choice. I'm going to have to... <laughs> oh, they're tickling him! <laughs> 
their torture method is, is tickling. Well, e <laughs> either way, I don't think we're going to be able to get out of the screen. We're going to have to give up the star, which stinks because we just got it. It was really exciting. Yeah, okay. Uh, how are we going to get the star back? Hmm. Looks like they're going back to the castle and they're running. I think I should try to chase after them. Can I check in on them? Uh, no, door's still locked. This is the only way they could have came out. And hey, look, there they are. Blade's late. Whoever Blade is. What's taking them so long? I don't know. This is just great. My, how, okay, I mean, this is a dead end. How was I not gonna... Oh, and our pirate buddies are coming to save the day. Not so fast. Okay, okay. see, Johnny. That's what happens when you make friends, guys. They come and help you out. Spineless dogs no code of honor. They'll make you walk the plank. Looks like they're going to give us the pleasure of destroying these guys. I uh, don't know what the fake elder Yardovich is going to do. He's going to take our disguises off now. And to a, do a uh, dance, I guess. Uh-oh, something's happening. Uh-oh, this is scary. Looks like Yardovich is here now. Hmm, he looks undead, doesn't he? Let's try a pure water. Oh, I think I'm out of pure waters, actually. Never mind. Let's try, you know, power boost. We got all the power guys in here, so I'm gonna go ahead and do a power boost for a eh, power blast for everybody. And let's take him out. Another boss, all these boss fights is in a row, though. It's nuts, isn't it? How, how's our power boost doing? Mmm, nice and lovely damage. Very nice. Okay, so Yardovich has the powers of water blast. Looks really scary. Now, that did quite a bit. Quite a bit. Uh, I'm gonna get Gino you know, an extra power boost. I wonder if I can get uh, that defense up again. Nope. Uh, I'll I have to figure that one out later. How are you gonna take a super flame to the face, I wonder? Let's try it out. Here, come on, baby. Do a lot. No, or don't. Whatever. Special defense is too strong on Yardovich. Let's go with the uh, normal tactic of throwing Mario at people. Willy Wisp has been a really common attack so far. It does quite a bit. I'm pretty sure it did like 60. Oh, 71. Gino goes down. Gonna need to help out Gino. We'll have... Oh, look at the health on everybody else, though. Uh, let's heal Gino now. And then Bowser can heal up the whole team. I think I have Kruka Cola. Oh, Froggy Drinks probably work, too. Where are my pick-me-ups? There they are. Found them. Gino, come back from the dead. You're welcome. Okay, now... Kruger Cola would be nice. Does Froggy Drink do the same thing? I wonder. What does Froggy Drink do? Should heal up everybody. Every oh, it only does 30? Ouch. That's I mean that's good for now, but would have liked it to do more. Kruger Colas are the way to go. Now I know of a way to get unlimited Kruger Colas. Back in Rose Town, I think we need like 200 coins to start out with to do it. So we gotta stay at the end and then just keep buying Kruger Colas and selling them back, which will give us like unlimited amounts of money, and then we can just keep doing it over and over again. So we might want to invest in that. Now, Mirage Attack, there's two. Now, the way to figure out which one is the real one is to do Mario or to do uh, Mallow's Thunderbolt Attack, and whichever one does more is the fake one. Unfortunately, Mallow is not an option right now, seeing as how he's gotten up. Oh, I didn't get to save it for a while, which kind of stinks because I only have this one pick me up. I should have bought more. There was a guy. Ah, oh, man, I thought I had enough. All right, so I'm going to guess guy on the left for now. So we'll see how that one goes. Actually, we'll hit them both. We're going to grab a masher. That one does 80, so that might be him. How much does we do to this guy? 192. So I'm going to guess that the 80 guy is going to be the real Yardovich. So he's going to be the one who we focus down for now. Nice little handgun from Gino. And I'm sticking with this strategy. It should... I mean, that makes sense, right? Wouldn't the uh, hard guy have way better defense? That's the way I would see it, right? It would suck to destroy... Uh, well, Bowser's glitching out. I don't know if you saw his head just disappear for a little while. That was a little creepy and strange. Let's keep attacking now. How much? How are we looking on health here? Health is Gino needs some help. I don't really want to waste Mario's excellent attack though. Bowser might have higher attack at this point. Now it's doing 182. That makes no sense. 
Where's my mid mushroom? Out of mid mushrooms. This should keep Gino alive for just a tad longer. And a free mushroom. Oh, and they're back, so that is fantastic. Now we don't have to worry about if I was hitting the right one or not. Yeah, I think, I think that's the way to go, honestly. And he's gone! We have defeated Yardovich, the easiest of all three bosses we have faced in the last couple episodes. So that's nice. Uh, nice try, guys. It looks like we should get our star back. Well, Mallow levels up to 13. How are we doing? Special attack. Ooh, a lot of health. Let's get some health from Mal. And the music has changed. Happy Seaside Town. Now we have the star back. Smithy apparently is now going for all the star pieces. Good luck. We have five of them. What are you going to do with two? What are you going to do with two? I'm going to get those two. And we're probably going to whip Smithy's ass. So that's exciting. We have a key and a note. What's the note say? Tomorrow. Knowing you must have been a breeze knocking down Yared. Yared, huh? Yeah. By the way, my pirates say they saw a huge axe flying across the sky. It's probably one of the Smithy's nasty friends. Go get him, pal. Well, my gills are failing on me, so I'll be heading back down. Drop in whenever you have time, okay? Your true mate, Jonathan Johnny Jones. Made a friend, got a key, and now we have a hint on what the next thing we need to do is. Apparently, there's a flying axe over the sky, and that might be one of Smithy's goons. Let's go save the people of Seaside Town. Hey, guys. What's up? You're welcome. Well, I mean, to be fair, your house is like literally the same size as this, so I don't know how you'd have enough of cramped spaces. Hey, fella! Got us up a piece, brother! Okay. Looks like they have a mole person here, which is cool. Hmm. You're welcome. You're welcome. I like, see, every time I save somebody, everybody showers me with thanks, and there should be gifts also. I don't know why they're not giving me anything. You're welcome. Gotta get back to work now. Stop by the inn. So we should stop by and see everybody and see if they give us anything cool. You're welcome. You gonna give me anything? <laughs> it was tickling, dude. Get over it. God, everybody gets tickled. Now the flower jar. There's a present. Now this thing has tons of things around. Check for secret boxes, like we do. I've not seen anything yet. So out the door. Moving on, we have the massive item stores. Let's check them out. See if we have anything we couldn't get before. Maybe some better stuff. Hey, Beetle. Welcome to Beetles R Us. We run a Beetle business here. One explanation. I'm not really sure what you mean, but yeah. So, looks like we need to purchase a Beetle box, which will cost us 50 coins. Go to Booster Hill, where there are many Beetles. Bring back the Beetle box filled with Beetles. You can trade them in for coins, etc. Okay. Menu list for information. So, what can we get if we uh, decide to get uh, Beetles? Oh, we can get, okay, so we get uh, 50 coins per male beetle, one coin per female. If we find the golden beetle, we get one frog coin. Might be worth investing some time into later on when I am collecting frog coins because I'm going to need them. Weapon and armor shop. Looks like the children are running this. Welcome to the weapon shop. What do you got for me? Troopa shell. Parasol. Hung, hurley gloves. We already have the hurley gloves. So I look like they're going to still be uh, relevant for later. A rivet stick from Mallow. Knock knock shell. Punch glove, finger shot, blah, blah, blah. All this stuff from earlier. It looks like he has every weapon from earlier almost. Which is pretty cool. I'm sure the trooper shell will probably be better. Can you not get more than 99... 999 coins? Hmm, I wonder. Don't, not really sure. Uh, going into the uh, next part of the game, I'm probably going to roll with uh, Mallow and Gino. So I'm going to bench Bowser for just a tad. So I'm going to grab the Trooper Shell for Mario. What's Double Punch? Gino. Double Punch for Gino and Ribbit Stick for Mario. And that should do it for them. That, that's the three I'm going to roll with for the next uh, round of people. So we're going to need the, the relevant armor for them. Uh, I have all the Sailor stuff already. So yeah, what's really cool is that I think they carry pretty much everything. So in these item shops, some, one should be an item shop. We're really health food store. Hopefully you got pick up, pick me up. So that'd be very very exciting mushrooms mid mushrooms no more mid mushrooms huh oh needs to pick me up so we're gonna pick up five freshen ups i just don't know what that does we'll grab some mis mid mushrooms just in case for later i know i think i've already checked all these uh shelves and stuff for the secret boxes but you know it, it can never hurt mushroom boy shop hey mushroom boy hey 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 i'm the mushroom boy did you know that hidden amongst the regular mushrooms are some special ones? Unreal! Give you items in return for special mushrooms, but you've got to taste them to find out what kind they are. Okay. 
So he's looking for special mushrooms. Uh, yeah, I have some mushrooms. Hey, far out! That was just right. <laughs> you're, you're welcome. What are you gonna give me though? That's what I want to know. Maybe there is, um, like special. I don't know. Maybe I'll find them now that I've talked to him. I'm not really sure. Accessories. Yeah, you're welcome. Thought I'll, yeah, okay, okay. Uh, my fashion is just fine. These, this red hat and blue overalls has been served me well for decades, ma'am. So, uh, I'm not gonna buy anything from you. We'll check out the inn now. What's going on in the inn? You should, uh, oh, save it. Gotta save it. It's been a little while. We had a bunch of fights since then. Seaside Town. Five stars. Yeah, that's, how, that's what I'm talking about. There we go. What's going on, girl? Mario, how nice of you to stop by. It's quite a trip for your place, isn't it? Hmm. Please rest up. Cost me 15 coins. That seems relatively cheap. I don't think I have a need to, but... It's been a while since we took a nap, right? So now that the nap has been taken... Let's get on out of here. Alrighty. What other houses can we go see, I wonder? I've already checked all that. Up here, there's a house up here. It has the Elder. Uh, Mario, if it's, if it's the star that you're looking for, I may be able to help you. At the far side of Land's End is a town made up of reformed monsters, huh? Hmm. So it looks like there's a star in the uh, place of, in a town that just has monsters in it, so... He can't help us find it because he has no idea where it is, but that's at least, you know, at least a lead. He's the guy with all the frog coin stuff. I don't have enough frog coins to buy anything, though, which is a little sad. So I think that is everybody. I think, uh, was this, this, this was the storage shed. It looks like there should be, like, an upstairs to this, but I guess not. Alrighty, though, we've checked out Seaside Town. Got showered with praise and gifts. So I will see you guys on the next episode of Super Mario RPG. I'm the J-Kid, you're the fans, and later, later... Whatever. So another another cool buy rhyme, I guess, that I didn't actually do. So bye bye.